Hi, thanks for being here again today. I have rather a long scripture to read to you from 1 Corinthians. And you remember St. Paul wrote 1 Corinthians to the people in Corinth. And in this section, he's explaining to them what he's able to do in order to share with people uh, the good news of the kingdom. Remember, he was a missionary and evangelist, one who traveled and established churches. After I read this, though, I want to apply this to a broader aspect of life. In fact, uh, absolutely everything we do and say as we interact with people. And I'm entitling the lesson, Love Makes Us Flexible. Listen to what Paul said. For though I am free with respect to all, I have made myself a slave to all, so that I might win um, more of them. To the Jews, I became as a Jew in order to win Jews. To those under the law, I became as one under the law, though I myself am not under the law, so that I might win those under the law. To those outside the law, I became as one outside the law. Though I'm not free from God's law, but I'm under Christ's law, so that I might win those outside the law. To the weak, I became weak, so that I might win the weak. I've become all things to all people, so that I might by all means save some. I do it all for the sake of the good news so that I may share in its blessings. Well, love makes us flexible. You don't have just one script, but Paul had learned that if he wanted to tell people about his way of being, his way of doing, his religion, that he would need to listen and he'd have to be open. So whatever it is in our lives that we're attempting to share with people, I suggest that we also adapt this mode of flexibility. People respond to us better when we speak their language, when we first take the time to respect them and understand their way of doing things. And you know, the interesting thing is, when we do that first, sometimes we discover that their way of being and doing is not only just as good as ours, but sometimes we decide to adapt it instead of convincing them to become one of our disciples. So whether you're, you're talking about politics or trying to convince somebody to listen to classical music or read poetry, or perhaps trying to share with them the love of God on their behalf, always be flexible. Be willing to listen first and then share with respect and genuine love. And it's this genuine love that will make you the most flexible and understandable person that you can be. Have a good day. I'll see you tomorrow.